What's up, Jean? How you doing? Hey, Cohen! I'm doing good. Thanks for asking. What about you? Honestly, I've been better. That's great to hear. Also, how have things been at home ever since you defeated Scar? Oh, not bad. We've been getting, being able to get a lot of stuff repaired after the destruction of Scar when he burned a lot of my farm. But other than that, it's going pretty good. That's good. Also, by the way, I've been thinking about what you said last week. About what that I said? What you said how you think King Ghidorah might have been the cause of all these different characters throughout the multiverse appearing here in the real world. I'm starting to actually feel this theory is actually true, and we might soon witness a multiverse paradox sooner than we think. I agree. Literally ever since he did the Alpha Call, there probably has got to be so many different creatures and even characters from other universes that are in the real world right now. Who knows what else could be out there right now. But thankfully, my dorsal play could definitely be able to help us out in protecting this universe from actual threats from other universes. For real! Also, by any chance, did you hear what the school announced recently? No, I didn't. What did the school announce? A student recently was reported missing while on his way to school. Nobody knows what happened to him. Oh shit. Well, that sucks. Well, where was this kid's last known location? It was told that he was last seen near an abandoned building just down the road of the school. That was the only known area he was located. He was never seen again after that. I see. Well, maybe after school today, I'll go by that place and check out, see if he's still there, probably. Are you insane? That place is very creepy. Who knows if there's any ghosts or paranormal activity going on in that place? I've witnessed and dealt with all kinds of creepy stuff. I'm sure this should not be a problem when I go over there. If you say so, just promise me that you will be careful. Don't worry, Jane. I promise you, I'll find that missing student and I'll get him back here safely. Don't worry. Target on my back, lone survivor last. They got me in the size. No surrender, no trigger, fingers go Living the dangerous life Hey, 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 every day when I wake I'm trying to get up, they're knocking me down Hey, 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 when I need to be saved You're making me strong, you're making me stand Shot like a rocket up into the sky Nothing can stop me tonight You make me feel This must be the abandoned building where that missing student was last seen at. It does look kind of creepy, but he's got to be in there. I'm sure of it. Jesus Christ, this place looks so messed up. Oh, pull yourself together, Cohen. Just got to find the missing student and then just get him out of here. End of that. I don't know about myself right now, but it honestly feels like I'm being watched right now. I don't know, my mind's just probably playing tricks on me. Alright, I've been searching for at least 5 minutes and nothing else, but... Wait, what the hell happened in there? Okay, I'm a little bit more concerned now. There's blood all over that room. Something really had to have happened here. Alright, I'm getting creeped out right now. I still haven't found- I've been looking- searched around for long enough and still haven't found a missing student anywhere. So I think I'm just gonna leave now. <laughs> what- what was that? It sounded like it was just coming from the basement. Oh god, I do not want to go down there. But he's- but who knows, maybe he's in there. I'm just gonna- I can think I'm just gonna go down there and just take a quick look and then just get back up here. Because I do not want to stay down there for long enough. Who knows what could even be down there. Good lord, it's so hard to see in here, it's so dark. 
Wait, what's that on the ground right there? It looks like some kind of huggy wuggy plush. But how did it end up in here? This seems very suspicious. Okay, what the hell was that? That was so not normal. That thing was like possessed or something. Now I think I really need to get out of here right now. Wait, I hear breathing. Wait a second. You have got to be shitting me right now. Huggy Wuggy? Wait, hold on. That hand in his mouth. Wait a second. You killed him. Oh shit, this is like the end for me. just happened wait how is my ankle fixed i swear to god I just broke okay there is too much weird shit going on right now what the hell are you supposed to be i am venom and you are mine venom you are that that alien symbiote who always likes eating people's brains correct Listen carefully. You did not find us. We found you. Think of yourself as my ride. Wait a second, how do you know my name? I know everything. You do? Everything about you. How? I am inside your head. You are a loser. Are you gonna, are you gonna eat anybody else? Most likely. <sighs> It is peaceful up here. Hey, look, man, I'm not really so good with heights, you see. Your world is not so ugly after all. 
I'm almost sorry to see you then. Hey, look, fam, this is nice and all, but how's it going to go back to my place? Because I got to get ready for school tomorrow morning. Whatever you say. Although I should make a phone call to the police about the missing student, so that way I can file a missing person report about this. This is CNN Breaking News. Breaking News. The mystery of the reported missing student at Woodstock Academy has been found. Another student informed that he was found dead in the abandoned building, just down the road of the school. The police went to look, but could not find the body. However, they did find a lot of blood in one of the rooms, alongside a severed hand that was found in the basement of the building. The student also explained that the victim's death was caused by a life-sized Huggy Wuggy toy, similar to the one from the iconic horror game, Poppy Playtime. When the police investigated, they found a smaller one alongside the body of a bigger one deeper within the facility. We are uncertain where this life-size toy came from, nor are we sure where the creature that killed King Ghidorah came from either. But the authorities are still on the case for it as we speak. At least the whole mystery of the missing student thing's all taken care of, but I so don't want the world to know about the I'm the creature that killed King Ghidorah. Oh, dinner's ready, Venom. Hope you're hungry. Oh yeah! So you see, Venom, recently I found this ancient Godzilla dorsal plate in a cave in the forest near my house, and it, when I equipped it, it granted me unlimited power. And I used this power to defeat a creature called King Ghidorah, from, which is a three-headed dragon from another universe, which attacked this universe, and I used this dorsal plate's power to defeat him. And I'm worried that if the whole world knows about this, they could do some awful experiments on me, and that's why I'm kind of trying to keep it a secret from the world right, right now. Now that is interesting. And see, this is another thing, Venom. Even though you found me, you live in my body and you must live by my rules. I live in your body because, right. unfortunately, I don't have many options. Well, how about this, Venom? The government is still trying to find out what killed King Ghidorah. And the last thing I need from you is to have two things happen at once when they have to experiment on me twice to find out where that ancient door split came from and also with you in my body. So you gotta get control of your, over your ego because if you don't, you're gonna get us held off into Area 51.
Ah. All right, another day of school today. Do you know what always cheers me up in the morning? Sausages and brains. I say either, and I say either, I say neither, neither, either, neither, 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 neither. Let's call the whole thing off. Ouch, 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 ouch. Potatoes, I like tomatoes, and I like tomatoes, potatoes, tomatoes, tomatoes, tomatoes. Let's call the whole thing off. Cheer up, old pal. Ta-da. Catch up. Excuse me. Yummy. Now, though, I'm just pleased to be one favor today and just try to stay out of sight and not try to interfere in my day today at school because I don't want to have to look looked at suspicious today, especially with you acting all crazy inside of my body. Yeah, anything for you, buddy! Okay, Venom, my friend Jane is going to be here any minute now, so just please be on your best behavior, please. I promise. Hey, Cohen, good to see you waiting for me. Hey, Jaden, what's up? Oh, nothing much, but thanks for asking. Awkward. So, uh, how's it going? How have things been? Rather well, if you ask me. Me and my parents went out to a nice romantic restaurant last night for dinner. What about you? Oh, not bad. One of our goats looks like they're about to give birth to some newborn babies pretty soon, so that's gonna be something to look forward to for me. Well, that's great to hear. I hope for the best for you guys. So, um... So? Well, I thought I would wait to tell you this in person, but... Tell me in person what? Me and my parents are attempting to get me signed for boot camp so I can train to go to the military. And we managed to succeed in having that happen this summer. No! Oh shit, wow. That's crazy. Ugh, it's gaudy. Yeah, it's really happening. Oh shit, I didn't expect that to happen so soon, man. Are you okay? Um, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. It's, I'm, I'm not, not okay. like upset or anything about it. Alright, I was just hoping you were gonna say that you're happy for me. Well, yeah, I I'm... Super proud of you, and no. yeah, that's that sounds pretty good. Yeah. Well, thank you then. That was going to be us. I, for one, would not be inconsolable if Dan were to fall into traffic and lose his head and his feet and all of his teeth. <clears throat> <clears throat> what was that? Are you sure you're okay? Yeah, I'm fine. It's just, hey, could you just excuse me for one second, Gene? I just gotta go to the bathroom real quick. I I'll be right back. Oh, hell no! No! Take your tiny hands off of me! We should be out there, protecting the city, lethally! Venom, what the hell was that back there? Unhand me! Man should never consent to crawl when he has the impulse to fly. You are a bottom feeder. Just be quiet! Didn't I just make it clear to you that I want you to stay put and be quiet while I'm at school? It's important that you have to show respect! Respect? Yes. Respect! Yes. Okay. okay. Cassidy gonna give you the scoop, right? Right. Wrong. What do you mean? Because you blow everything. Uh, I see what you're talking about, right? I miss her. Sorry! I don't know what came over me. You know something, Venom? For her being one of my closest friends, you really should be given the, the respect she really deserves for her wanting to go to the military. I'm proud of her for doing that kind of career. And as for me, I'm looking at becoming the savior of the multiverse pretty soon with that ancient doors play I found. And with you showing the respect that you're giving right now, that's the same kind of respect you should be giving to Jaden. Basically showing us the same amounts of respect. Got me? Yeah, I respect that. I'll give you and your wife some a long time. Good. Now just be quiet and stay put until school is over. Wait, what the hell? It sounds like the fire alarm. Something must be going on. Wait, Jaden, what's going on? Why is the fire alarm going off? The school is being evacuated because there are two serial killers loose in the building. Wait, two serial killers? Oh shit, well, let's get out of here. What are you doing? Running away! What does it look like? You are making us look bad! 
Have you forgotten how we encounter with that giant? Venom, now's not the time to catch up on old memories. What we're saying is if we can take on a... should be a walk in the park. Do you really think we can do it, Venom? We know we can do it. Okay, I trust you. They're serial killers. Wait, Cletus Cassidy? Wait, how do you know my name also? I don't want you to freak out, okay? Uh, where are you going? What are you doing? This is much worse than I thought! That is a red one! Wow! Uh, red one. We should leave! Immediately! Annie will get over it! We never liked her anyway! So, let's go! No. Congratulations to the happy couple! We are leaving! <laughs> hey, I'll be with you in a minute. Just hold on. Okay, look, we need to come out right now. Because I'm feeling super, super vulnerable right here. It's just like you. Not for long. <laughs> Over here! Please, you need to come out right now. I will let you eat everybody. You can eat them all. Promise! I promise! Oh, yeah! Thank you! That's the spirit! I mean us! We are going to die! He's too strong. We gotta find another way to defeat him. Well, I don't think the sound part's gonna work because I think Carnage must have broken all the fire lines in the building. 
Wait a second. Venom, quick. We need to get to the kitchen. I found a way to defeat him. Killer, with or without the monster. <laughs> you know what I really wanted? And what was that, Cletus? Told you, but you weren't listening. Well, I'm listening now. I wanted your friendship. I'm sorry, Cletus. Fuck this guy! Come on, Venom. Let's get out of here. Wait, hold on, Venom. Stop. Hold on a second. My body kind of hurts a little bit. I think when Carnage threw me into that wall, it kind of hurt me a bit. Ah! Yeah, sure, I'll go to hospital. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah, I think there's just one down the road of here. We can go to that one, Venom. Ladies, it seems we have an unruly patient on the loose that must be dealt with. Lethal Mercy is authorized! 